back to my channel so if you're new here go ahead click that subscribe button and click that notification button right next to it so when i post new videos you can come and chill with me so today you saw the the title of the video so you already know what's going on but before i do that let me show you the nails of the video because every time i do a video i feel like i have new nails nails of the video yes it's giving how the grinch stole christmas and i love it um so yeah, like I said, you already saw the title, so you already know what's going on. Now, let me just let me let, let me let me just tell you about this video. Okay, so I tried to do this video last year and I was gonna do it with my mom, but she flaked out on me. And that's okay because you know life gets busy around the holidays, and that's fine because it's like my birthday and then two weeks two weeks later it's Christmas. By the way, I have a birthday vlog that I filmed. Let me know if you want to see it. It it, it could it could be a month late, that's fine. But if you want to see it, leave a comment down below, leave a like, send me a DM, I don't care, just let me know. But yes, I tried to make this video a whole year ago, whole year ago. Saw this advent calendar in Sam's and I thought I have to try all 12 bottles of wine like, and, and make a video on it. So that's what we're doing today. I think this is so cool and it's, it's 12 days of wine. So there's 12 little things and you just poke holes in it. And I, I'm, I'm genuinely so excited to see what type of wine is in here and maybe I might find favorite because if you know me or you follow me on my social medias you know that I love me some wine you know it could be a glass it could be the whole bottle depending on what day it is depending on how stressed I am who knows I don't know but I love drinking some wine and I love trying new wines I hate the wines that are bitter I love the wines that are sweet so I feel like this one is gonna have a mix and I'm very excited to taste them so I'm done rambling let's get into the video because I'm just excited so God damn, let's, let's get into it. Okay, so it's numbered on here. You can't see, but there's little tiny numbers and there, it doesn't go in order. So like this is one, this is two. I don't know where three is, but we're gonna start with number one and just get into it. I got nails. Like, I don't know how I'm supposed to open this. I thought this was just the coolest thing when I saw it in the store and it's 12 bottles of wine. <laughs> Okay, I need help. Oh my God. I got, I got some help. So let's see. Oh, it's red. Oh my God, it's so cute. Look how cute. Look, you even see, it say 2019 on this thing. Wait, it say 2019. I swear, I promise on everything I love, I. I got this last year. So I don't know why this thing say 2019, but anyway. Oh wait, is it the year? It's the year, huh? Okay, I guess it's the, tw cause it says 2019 Cabernet Sauvignon. Is that how you say it? Is that how you say it? I don't know, I don't know. Let's just get into it. I was gonna do a video where I drink the whole bottle, but I have work in the morning and ain't nobody got time for that. So I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try it. <laughs> Oh my God, I need help again. <laughs> I have received help. Okay, wait, let's see what it says on the back. Oh, it says 2019, it's made in Lodi, California. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I didn't get this last year though, but okay, I got it. Um, ooh, 14.3%, okay. Does it say if it's sweet or not? Okay, whatever, we about to find out. Oh Lord. Okay. Cheers. Whew. Okay. I mean, it's not bad, but it tastes like, it tastes like nasty water, but like, if you thirsty, you'll drink it. For 17%, you know, oh, 14%. For 14%, I'll chug this. Like, it's in a little cute. You can have, like, this is a nice little buzz for the day or something, for the night, whenever. Okay, I'm, I don't I don't think I was a fan of that one. Oh, God. Okay, let's on to the next. That's one. This one's two. I, 
God. You know what? The damn box open. We gonna open it, cause I'm sick of this. This is ridiculous. We gonna open it. Am I dumb? Am I dumb? Damn. Fine, okay. Okay. Got number two. Ooh, okay, it's a white. It's a white. Got some Chardonnay. What year is it? 2019, Central Coast, okay. Cool, it's 14.5%, so. Is Chardonnay usually sweet? Why did they wrap this up like it was like why did they make it like why did they make it hard to get into? It's like they don't want me to try it. I need more help. You you might as well just sit a little bit closer. Got it. help has arrived. Okay. Sick of these wines smelling like this. I'm gonna be drunk by the end of this video. It don't smell great. It don't smell great, y'all. Mm mm. I'm scared. Oh god. Okay. I have to commit and take a gulp. I told myself I would at least gulp it. That almost made me throw up. I don't like that one. I don't like that one at all. These are nasty. They better have some sweet up in here somewhere. Does it say what they got? Okay. I can't do this. I. Can't. Oh, does it open? We opened it, y'all. We opened it. Okay, wait. Now I don't remember what is what. Okay, these are. Those are nasty. Okay, so let's flip it. So number three, that would be this one. Number three. Oh God, it's another red one. Thank you. So another red one. I don't know how I feel. I'm starting to get a little warm. The wine is definitely, those two sips. Cause that's the thing about wine y'all. When it's the nasty ones like these two, you can take two sips and you be feeling it. I like my little Stella Rose, my Barefoot, my, um, the the Roscato, if you haven't had Roscato, go to your store. If you of age, if you of age, go to and, and try the Roscato. But I like sweet. I want it to taste like juice so that way when it hit me, it's like, oh cool, I was just drinking juice. This they smell not dirty, but they smell dirty, if that makes sense. I don't like how this smells. This smells like I'm about to be disappointed. That last one always made me throw up. I know I just refuse to throw up on camera though, but I'll let a little gag out every now and then. I got my water in case it's nasty because that last one was ridiculous. Oh my God. This is not fun. People like this stuff. Oh my God. This is disgusting. This is disgusting. Zifidel is enough. It's enough for me, dog. Number four. Okay, we got a we got a, a white one. Um, this is Sau Sauvignon Blanc. Okay, I think that's how you say it. Is that how you say it? <laughs> Literally in here cracking it with her teeth. Like, what is wrong with her? My chest is getting a little warm and I'm gonna have to roll my sleeves up. Hold up. Hopefully I'm not ashy, but. So this is white wine. Let's see, uh, alcohol percentage, 13.5. So we're going lower. We're getting lower, which is good. This one doesn't smell too bad, but it smells like, it smells, I've noticed that these bitter ones, Kind of got like a, they're not musty. No, I'm not saying they musty, but 
They just smell just off to me. The sweet ones, it smell like sweet juice. Okay, not bad. Okay, so I'm seeing a pattern. These 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 white ones, they popping up, and um, they taste like dirty water. Like I don't know, I don't know how to explain it anywhere else. They just taste like dirty water to me. But smooth, not as bad as these red ones. Red wine, bitter red wine to me is like is the easiest way to torture me. Give me red wine that's nasty like those two. I'll tell everything. So five. Oh my God, it's another red one. It's Cabernet. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, so this is number five. Um, it is a Cabernet Sauvignon Merlot. <laughs> I think that's how you say it, because I, I swear I know it's not Cabernet. I'm not that illiterate, you know? Um, let's see, this one's 13.8, so we went a little bit up. Your jaw don't hurt? Uh, let's see. No, no, <laughs> no, I don't want to drink it. I don't, don't want to drink it. It smells dirty. <laughs> I don't like how this smells. This is, this is, this is not fun. If you drink any of these that I have tested, is everything okay at home? Like, for real, are you good? Cheers. That tasted, that tasted like plaster. I don't even know what plaster tastes like, but I feel like this is what it would be. And you know what? This, this wine has been sitting in my kitchen, just aging even more. So it should have more flavor and more, you know, and these is nasty as hell. I just, no offense to the company that made these because I'm pretty sure, you know, there's somebody out there that will love those, but not I. So this is number six. It is a Pinot Grigio. Um, yeah, I'm halfway done. Um, I'm halfway done and I'm just, at this point, I feel like I'm just really thinking, what did I get myself into? But it's okay, it's okay. Can you just sit, like not sit, but you know, okay. So you know how you mix brown and clear, you know, alcohol? Can I get sick? No, like for real, can I get sick from, like if I, will I get sick from mixing red and white and all these different wines or is wine just wine and you drink it and you just gonna be good? Oh my God, I'm feeling it. This video is progressively just gonna get worse. So, <laughs> oh, it touched my lip. I don't want it, I don't want it. <laughs> Okay, I'm plugging my nose because I, I just, I, I, I can't. Oh, that one wasn't bad. Okay, that wasn't bad. I don't know if it's because I plugged my nose and I really couldn't taste it or what, but like when I unplugged my nose, so when I swallowed it, I can kind of taste it. That one wasn't bad. Okay, so you know what? That one's gonna be at the top. Okay, so number seven. Perfect, another red. Um, this one is a Merlot. Didn't I just try a Merlot? Hold up. Cabernet Sauvignon. That was a Merlot. But this is just a regular Merlot. This one's a 2018. So it's this one's three years aged. You know, at this point, you know, I, I just feel like this is karma for me personally. Like I chose my own karma and now I have to go through with it because not that YouTube is my job. I would definitely like it to be my full-time job, but I got to finish this video. I ain't no punk, so let's get it. Cheers.
These red ones are really disappointing me. That one tasted like chalk. I'm gonna just move on. I have no comment. Ooh, it's pink! Ah, it's pink! What is this? This has gotta be a rose. This is a, this, this is a rose. Okay, we got 13.3%. Let's go ahead. I, I'm ready to try this one. I love me some rose. Okay, we, we got a saving grace here. It smells weird. Why does it smell like this? It smells like nasty. I mean, you know what? This real wine stuff is throwing me because I need I need these types of wines to start getting like Stella Rosa because they know they know what they're doing. They, it, none, of, none of they want is nasty. Mm, nine. Oh, God. How many? I got. I got three wet red wines left. Let me drink some water. This one is. This one is a red blend. What, what does that even mean? It don't even got a year on it or nothing. 14.5%. That means it's about to be nasty. That's what it means. That's exactly what it means. I, I am so ready to get this over with. I just, this is, this is not it. Yep, I smell it. It smells nasty. Let's just, I'm gonna plug my nose because I don't even want to do this. eyes water Ugh. you know how nasty something gotta be to where you plug your nose you still taste it and I still gag no 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 let's just let's go on to the next one so this is number 10 it's a Cabernet Sauvignon it's a Syrah Syrah S-Y-R-A-H I don't know, but it looked nasty. It's 14.5% again. Like, I'm over it. Like, I just know it's about to be nasty. Y'all see my face getting all red because I'm getting a little, I'm getting a little lit. This is just, I'm just it This is not fun. I do it for y'all though, because like this is, it was a fun idea. I really thought I would find a wine that I like and all these about to go in the trash or I don't know. <laughs> you know how when you like, okay, you know when you, you, you got a campfire and you got wood burning and like you grilling and stuff, that's what it smelled. It smelled woody. It smelled oaky. It smelled like I'm at a barbecue. It smelled like I'm at a campfire. It smell like wood. Do they be having wooden cellars? They they be putting them in wooden barrels, huh? It smell like the barrel it was in because this is just this is this smells this smells like wood. This smells like nature, and I don't like that. I know, like our wines made out of grapes. What kind of grape is this bitter? I'll wait. Cheers. All these is nasty. Okay. So the thing is, this is number 11. This is number 12. I'm done with that box. This is 11. This is 12. I refuse. I refuse to drink this one last. Because I know it's going to be nasty. And I know this is going to be a little bit easier. So let's pretend this is 11 and this is 12. Okay. Okay. Cool. So this one is a Pinot Noir. Noir? Noir, no wire, N O I R. Y'all, y'all got it because I tried to sound it out and that's not helping. Anyway, <laughs> 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 so. 
So like I said, I tried to sign it out. I don't know, I don't know what, I don't know how to pronounce that word. So <laughs> we're just gonna leave it at that. It's 14.2% alcohol, so that means it's gonna be nasty. Cheers. Nasty. Nasty. Tastes exactly like the one I just tasted right before. Disgusting. This is good old number 12. Let's see what this is. It is a sweet Riesling. R Riesling? Riesling? That sound right. Riesling? Riesling. I before E, so Riesling. Riesling. I don't know. I don't know. I tried to sign it out. I don't know. Um, it is 12.2%. That's a good amount. That means it, this is the only 12% that we've had out of all of them. So it might be good. And it says sweet. It says sweet. Y'all see it? It says sweet right there. We go see if that's true. Do the honors, please. Moment of truth. This is the last one out that stupid box. I am so glad that this is over. This has been an experience. This has been a journey. Um, and I'm, I'm hopefully let's end it on a good note. Let's end it on a good note. Cheers. This one smell. This one smells okay. This one smells like my Stella Rosa or my barefoot. This one doesn't smell too bad. Let's go, let's go, we got this. I mean, I wanna put it in my collection. It's kind of an acquired taste, you know what? I feel like I would put this in my, in my collection. This one doesn't taste too bad. Take another sip. Oh God, I don't want this in my collection. It's not bad. The aftertaste just tastes like weird. The after <laughs> <laughs> the after. It tastes like nature. I can't explain it any better than that, but the aftertaste tastes like bitter nature. Like if I was to eat a leaf, I feel like that's what it would taste like. If you like tasting wood and you just you just love nature and you wanna just taste it and get drunk off of it, definitely try one of these or plaster or chalk or any of, any of the above things that I have said in this video. Definitely try these things out. Well, that was, that was, that was, that was something. I don't know exactly what it was besides, um, a whole experience that just got me drunk, but that's fine. That's fine. I'm gonna love editing this tomorrow, but that was fun. That was cool. I'm gonna go lay down because it's starting to hit me a lot now, but if you like this video, and you want me to try more things like this, definitely leave me a comment down below because I, you know, although it was nasty, I still had fun. I still had a lot of fun. Um, leave me a comment down below on what videos you want me to see, want me to do next, what you want to see. Um, I can't think. Like I said, leave a comment down below if you want my birthday vlog. Um, it was really cool. I love my birthday. I got this gorgeous ring. I don't know if y'all can see it. You see the heart? You see the heart? It's a promise ring, girl. <laughs> and it's where? It's from where? It's from, hold up, hold up. It's from where? Y'all see that blue? Y'all see that blue? It's from Tiffany. You already know the drill. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification button. 
hit that like button. All of that helps me out, helps my channel, and helps me know what I should post for my next video. Because sometimes, I'm not gonna lie, I don't be, I, I struggle coming up with things. So if you follow me on social media, shoot me a DM. I promise I answer people. I have texted my subscribers back. I have called my subscribers. I have sent my subscribers money. So just whatever you wanna do, hit me up. I'm just a regular person. Hit me up on the socials. I'll definitely reply. Anything else? I can't remember. I don't know. I'm out of it. I'm a little tipsy. I gotta go. I'm hot. I turned the AC off for this. Peace.